every one of you. I'll try it one more time and you need to go. <clears throat> Well, that's better. Those of you that are in the dark, you're very hard to see. So, just move a little bit further this way. Come a little closer. Get very, very friendly. You're going to get friendly with people over the next couple of days, so please do so. Keep moving up. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Peter Oliver. I work for the International Water Centre in Brisbane which is a, a, a joint venture of four universities, University of Queensland, Griffith University, Monash and University of Western Australia. And I um, had the pleasure there and the privilege very much of coordinating a Masters in Integrated Water Management. I've been associated with um, land care in various ways, water watch and catchment management since about 1990 in Queensland and other places. And it's my great pleasure tonight to have accepted an invitation to, uh, to, to MC the conference here at Monto. This is my first time at Monto and I think it's, um, just from what I've seen this afternoon, there were things I didn't expect. I didn't expect to be sitting on a buggy behind Jack the Horse. <laughs> I didn't expect that there'd be such a lovely town. I didn't expect that the showgrounds would be set out so well that the council would have done such a great job getting things organised. I didn't expect the, the vibrancy that's here and the, the amount of work and organisation that's gone on. So I'm really looking forward to uh, three days of learning a lot about sustainability by design and what it means at so many different levels. At the level of a small town, at the level of a regional community, what it might mean nationally, what it might mean internationally. Um, you'll be meeting lots of people that you know here uh, and networking. You'll also be meeting lots of people who I hope will be new. From the International Water Centre we brought um, students from various places with us. You'll meet people from um, a range of places, from Vietnam, from Pakistan, from Ecuador, from Wales, from Canada, from France, from French Ivory Coast, also from Australia. <laughs> there are also delegates who've come and I really am welcoming the delegates and saying this. We've got people from Western Australia. Where are you Amanda? You might win the prize for coming from furthest away. There are people from um, Canberra, there are people from South Australia. It's great to see people here in Monto tonight. The first thing I would like to do is really ask for your attention, please, while we have a very formal part of the ceremonies. I'd, as I said, I'd like to thank the North Burnett Landcare Group for the invitation to, uh, to be here today, particularly their chair, Trevor Gleeson. Um, I'd also like to uh, uh, acknowledge Sam Morris, but the first group of people I'd, I'd like to acknowledge are the Woolly Woolly people. And I would um, like to ask um, Mrs Phyllis Lee to, uh, to, to do an Indigenous welcome to country. Could we please welcome Phyllis? Thank you, Peter. <laughs> I'd like to introduce myself, Phyllis Lee. My maiden name is Pope, descendant of the Willy Willy peoples. It was passed down to us that the other side of Kaninda Range, the No-Go River, is Willy Willy country. Please tell me if this area is not part of the Monto district and I will apologise for my elders who are not here to speak for their traditional areas. Aboriginal people believe nobody owns the land. The land owns us. It is so true. The land dies, we die. We refer to earth as our mother earth. If we care for the land, the land will care for us. I would like to thank Michelle for inviting me as a Willy Willy Elder and community member of Monto to give a traditional welcome to our visitors. So on behalf of the Willy Willy and Garang peoples, 
on whose traditional land we are gathered tonight, welcome. And may everybody have a successful few days. May your journey back home be safe. Thank you.